Hi, I'm Robert, and I'm here to tell you about the exciting new NPW DMX Snapshot Controller. This is the first product released by both the group at Enlight and Pathway Connectivity Solutions. And as you get your demo case and you open it up, the first thing you'll see inside is the card with the um, Passcape recovery key and password. We'll get to that in a minute. Um, but after you plug in the IEC cable, it'll take about a minute for things to boot up. And even before you plug in any other cables, one of the quick things you can do and commissioning agents would do often is press the test button to make sure that things are wired correctly. So I'm gonna press this test button here and what you will see is our test LED fixture. This is a, an array of uh, 4x4 16 LED RGBs that are going to represent the stage, the DMX theatrical fixtures. They will start running in a chase of colors so you can see all of the emitters are working. And you'll also see the white light that we have underneath these wall stations is fading up and down. So just with a single press of the button before you do anything on the network, you can see that things are wired correctly and talking on the network. And we'll just press the test button again and that will disable the feature. The other thing to note is that as it is in the test mode, the identify LED will fade up and fade down. Now, getting into the network portion of this, we have the end light jacks, the dual end light jacks that you see here, and the one that's marked Passcape, which is where I will plug in my Ethernet uh, to talk to the Passcape network. On the end light side, I happen to have a, an Eclipse, but you might have an Encom kit. And when you look at the port, you will see four devices underneath it. We have the NPW DMX itself. We have the Neo, which will control the white light LED. And we have an, an NPOD M2P, which is this guy here. And we have an NPOD M2S with the DX, which is here. So as I open up uh, and highlight different things. I'll just highlight the NPW DMX here and I will go to output one and in the device overview, if I press the identify, you will see that the white lights on our LED tile blinked. I'll just press identify and they blink. So let's collapse that down. And if we highlight the Neo, which is connected to the Eldo LED solo drive, and we press identify here, you will see the white light will curtsy. And then we'll highlight the 2P, which is the one on the left here. Let's just identify it. And we see its lights blink. And then we will do the 2S. And I will touch that and it will curtsy there. Now, let's go over to Passcape. When you go into Passcape and you look at the end light snapshot view, you should see the vignette wall station, the VIA 8 port, and the snapshot controller itself. Now, you are going to need to use the password that's on here before you get the green padlocks, so you need to log in Seeing the security domain is NPW DMX demo, and you type in the password supplied. And when you do that, you will get green padlocks here. So if we select the vignette POE wall station and we do an identify, you will see it will just blink its lights. And here we will have to turn off unidentify. And if we go and highlight the VIA 8, and we press identify, it will identify using its status LED. And then if we go to the snapshot controller itself and press identify, it will blink its identify LED. 
So now you have a functioning system. If you just want to see how it operate in real life, you can push up the first slider and you will get red LEDs across the whole array, green and blue on the third slider and also pressing on the 2P, the first, you will get white light on DMX and white light on the solo drive. And press that and it fades out. So that's a very quick overview of the demo case that uh, highlights the NPW DMX. And join me next time as we take a deeper dive into what you see in both Passcape and sensor view.